Hi, I'm Akanksha Sharma. I work at Pacific Neuroscience Institute as a neurologist, neuro-oncologist, and palliative care specialist, and this is a PNI Minute. So one of the things that people sometimes are surprised about is that radiation doesn't just last during the treatment time. The effect of radiation will continue on for several months after radiation ends. So it's not something that is just working while you're getting the treatment every day. It's something that continues to work in the months afterwards. That might mean both the positive effects of slowing down tumor growth or stopping tumor growth completely, but that also means that sometimes the inflammation that comes from radiation treatment can present in the months after or even the years after. And this is something that we continue to learn a lot about because now we find that thanks to new drugs and new interventions and new types of radiation, patients are living longer. So they're alive six, seven, 10, 15 years after brain tumor treatment. This is great, but this also means that now we're seeing some of the long-term side effects of radiation also come up. In the most immediate period after radiation or during radiation, we usually see swelling, inflammation that can look like headaches, nausea, vomiting, confusion, seizures. And this is something that's usually alleviated with steroids and patients can feel better after a brief period. This is usually the first six months after radiation. After six months, we start seeing something called radiation necrosis or the delayed effects of inflammation or radiation. Uh, this can present in a similar manner, but it may look different on imaging and it may be treated differently. And this will depend on a discussion with your oncologist. It's important to recognize that radiation effects can happen during the treatment, but also for many months or even years afterwards. And so it's important for you to get treatment for someone who understands those side effects and those risks and keeps an eye on your symptoms. Mm -hmm.